B2H, back at it again. Ah, yes, another dream workshop. Today we're going to take a look at a set that they changed. Oh no, it used to be a very tanky set. We're going to make a, make a slight adjustment. Now we're looking back and it's uh, this new, new DPS class. Classy Hunter's Faith. Very nice. That's okay. I've been working on my sniping a little bit with the uh, Devil's Heel on my uh, Sentry's Call. So it's a okay by me that uh, they want me to use a bolt action to get stacks, much like you would on a uh, striker build. Do not mind. But, uh, I'll just, I'll take it slow. Because I don't have it complete yet. I have, uh, questions that maybe, uh, some of you in the chat could answer. But, uh, even if you don't... Supply drops incoming. I'll Uploading wing it anyways. You are now entering a Here safe we are area. again. Building. I've already thrown together some stuff. I mean, I did the prep work, you know. You might say, hey, uh, that's a rather balanced approach to it. And I say, yeah, yeah, I know. But, um, shut up. Okay, so let's take, <laughs> let's take a look. Let's take a look at the top, huh? Let's, uh, as we usually do. Let's start from the top. We're looking at the stats, the three main ones. We got firearms, stamina, electronics. Firearms. We're at 6k, almost a flat. We're at 6,007. If you got the sound effect there, there you go. The golden eye, the whatever you want. Bond. Gold bond. Uh, 6K because of the a new agent is uh, joining your team. triggering of the hunter's faith. Uh, it's based on firepower and in intervals of 3K. Oh, hey, Joker! I'm I'm trying to describe to people my build real quick. I'll join up with you in a little bit, okay? I'll, I'll, I will join on you. Is that okay? <laughs> I'll see you in a bit. Alert, an agent has left your team. <laughs> the, uh, stamina. I've been, I've been proposing that, uh, now that health is back, that we're in a very stamina-driven meta. Um, and this is a continuation of that, because, uh... There's a lot of firepower boosts, a lot of damage boosts in this build already. Um, we may already have enough damage at 6k, and I want to test that. And if that's the case, then damn, we can be pretty beefy. Uh, if this is where we can be at, uh, I would like to have uh, as much stamina as I can roll. Uh... Well, not necessarily as much as we can rule. I have two mods in here that give me a little bit of electronics just to boost uh, my abilities a little bit. Um, and those two electronics mods have uh, skill power on them. Just to, we, you need a little bit of skill power uh, because of what the skills I'm rolling. Um, Let's get into that uh, in a moment. Let's talk about the abilities on these guns and how we mod them, huh? Just like any headshot build, uh, we're talking about headshot mods. I mean, that's the basis of it. Um, you can do it any way you want to do after that. I mean, I like stability. Um, if you're going for all damage, there you go. Your crit chance, crit damage. Those little 4 percenters, I mean, I guess they add up over time, you know. When you get a couple of them going, but 
it's, it's not very good compared to the 19% crit damages, so it's whatever. Uh, I threw reload speed on this covert. This is my close range sniper. Uh, for anything, you know, like 16 closer meters, that is. Um, this is the guy I go to to uh, s smash people when they're 60 meters. 60 meters is close. Uh, and then I got the expanded mag, crit chance, rate of fire. I mean, reload speed would be fine too. I'm just kind of bouncing around, see what I want to try. So I got the rate of fire boost. The, the thing is, rate of fire really isn't going to help you on these things. Like, look, it's not even... It's whatever. I feel like uh, reload speed is probably your best bet on these things. I'm, I, I mean, if anybody in the chat knows, does the reload speed affect that bullet? Because uh, these are bolt action. So when you fire, does it affect that reload of the bullet into the... Uh, uh, when you're chambering the bullet after you fire. Is that is that part of it? Because if that's part of it, then I say f f boost the shit out of your reload speed so you can speed that shit up. Uh, that's real important to me. Um, I got the 700 uh, carbon. Uh, this is my... <laughs> I'm a little overboard. Okay, max distance. Alright, I kinda... There's, there's a reason I want the range on this thing to be pretty good, okay? So we still got, we got the damage, we got the headshots, uh, vert grip, okay? That's the reason why it's kind of absurd. It doesn't have the reload speed. We got 15 rounds in the mag, so it's whatever. We got the reload speed a little bit in there. Um, crit chance, yeah, it's, it's fine. It's fine. 10% reload speed in there. Between the two uh, pieces here it's, it's whatever we'll be okay make it work um, talents wise uh, the reason why this is the closer range of the two is it's a brutal toxic vicious mix um, I may slow think about putting meticulous in here Meticulous seems really advantageous for a Hunter's Faith build. Um, we'll go over that when we look at the actual text of the build. Uh, the mechanics of how Hunter's Faith works. Because um, I'm used to working with stuff like Lone Star where Meticulous, you want to avoid like the plague. Unless you're using something like uh, sawn off shotguns. Uh, but <clears throat> if you um, if you go for headshots, brutal's great. Toxic's hilarious. Uh, vicious. It's just because I feel like we're gonna be at range and I'll be able to hit them with crits pretty consistently. It's kind of nice. It's a nice thing to do with headshots. Uh, the carbon. Um, this is my long range gun. Prepared, obviously a good choice. Brutals, also headshots. We're doing headshots all day. That's all this build's about. Elevated. Um, game plan with the M700 is to take the high ground and shoot at people from really far away. So that it doesn't matter if they're behind stuff. I can still hit them. There is no cover that can save you. I will get you. We'll see. We'll see how that plays out. But we got two different snipers. Uh, if I have to, I can always put prepared on this guy, too. Um, we'll see. Play around with it. I haven't figured it out yet. I've got a backup uh, M700. I think it's a tactical something. It's in the inventory. It's missing the uh, grip. The carbon has the uh, grip attachment, which is kind of nice. Um... Oh, jeez, what happened? Audio just cut out. Let's see. Huh? It's still, still here. What's going on? 
It's so quiet. Where did it all go? I'm scared. It's so quiet. God, what happened? Is this is this the audio bug? Huh. Oh, in the meantime, I guess uh, we'll just finish up here. Uh, <laughs> I log back in just to... It's going down. I've also got the double barrel sawn off. Uh, this is a determined guy, just because we want determined. Everybody's been doing this lately. They do the... Uh, heal they usually have pred predatory on here as well. They usually finish off people with this guy. They can heal. They get their uh, signature skill back. Very cool. All right, let's look at Hunter's Faith. Uh, specifically, uh, Hunter's Faith, fourth slot here. We, I mean, you get optimal range uh, and headshot damage, right? Two things, fantastic. Great. Uh, so we're a headshot build at range. The fourth set bonus is each consecutive fo uh, shot with a bolt action marksman rifle. That makes me sad. I was hoping a bolt action, so maybe like a. Um... Oh, I was gonna think MDR, but I think that's a semi. So uh, that hits an enemy, deals three percent more damage. The damage bonus increased by four percent for every three thousand firearms. That's why we're at the six K. It uh, times two of that, so that's 8%. So we're up to 11% every time we headshot somebody. Pretty good bonus. Bonus damage is removed once a shot misses a target upon weapon swap or reload, or after 10 seconds. So rate of fire is important. And... What else would be important here? Reload. So, I was thinking Meticulous might be cool, but it seems as though after 10 seconds it doesn't matter, so you're going to end up reloading or whatever. It doesn't matter too much. Weapon swap. Uh, meticulous still might be cool. That means, like, at the end of your weapon, if you kill something, you could still keep this thing going because it would uh, refill your uh, magazine. Set 5, you get more optimal range, more headshot damage. So we're up to 20% on headshot damage. Uh, headshot, uh, double the gained increased damage bonus. Need two shots, two consecutive missed shots to lose the bonus damage. Okay, so... Instead of the 11%, we get the... 22%. Right? So 22, 44, 66, 88. And then uh, max. So it takes you, uh, f you know, five shots. Whereas you would only take, uh, what, three for 90 and then f a fourth for max damage on the... Uh, 9,000. So you, you move up slower on Hunter's Faith on the uh, 6,000. The slower shot. But I'm, I'm thinking the damage on headshots might be pretty good here. Let's see. But uh, the armor... Um, health on kill might be viable since you're, uh, this is a DPS class. This isn't like a support class. This is like a straight up Rackham at range class. Um, crit chance, you're increasing damage on the mask. Uh, health rolls, because, uh, this is what I'm going for. We're trying to, we're trying to meet up with the, uh, stamina meta. Uh, I might get rid of this guy down here yet. Yeah. Not, not sure. We got burn shock, so that would probably be bleed resist. 
just to round out that to make it more of a god rule bad. Uh, Hunter's Faith backpack, I rolled health, ammo cap, standard stuff. Gloves, crit chance, uh, marksman rifle damage, uh, critical hit damage. You could do skill haste in there too if you wanted. Depends how you want to play it. Depends what abilities you're using. I'm doing reload speed because uh, I am thinking that the bolt action reload is influenced by reload speed. I'm still uncertain. Uh, I need someone who's more of an expert on that to uh, tell me yes or no on that. But whatever, you know. Uh, okay, so that about covers most of that. Uh, skills. Um, using mobile cover. Cause I want to take the high ground. I want to use that um, elevation. I want that M700. I want to try that a bit. I want to see if we can find some spots where we can uh, utilize countermeasures. Be Sneaky Pete. Be a bud. We'll be immune to uh, pulses. We'll hit people and pulse them. And anyone who gets close gets tased. And then we get some free headshots in on them. It's for me, I think. It's for me. It's... Uh... I think if you were going to run this, another thing you might want to run would be this guy right here, life support station. As a sniper, you're usually far enough away, whereas if you get accidentally downed at some point by, like, some weird, like, predator's bleed, um, you can usually have this guy res you before you bleed out. Um, who knows? We'll see. It's funny stuff. But, uh, I haven't really decided on what to do with this guy. I think I want one is none, to be honest with you. Because, uh, my experience with the Devil's Heal, using two snipers in the past, is that, uh, one is none. Great ability for get, keeping your ammo together. Um, and then using tactical advance and evasive action, uh, we can use the mobile cover on the ground and above, uh, so we can tactically place it um, above them to get that elevation damage or we can place it wherever we need to just so we can be in the fight and take less damage, face tank people make them uh, regret trying to uh, scope us down just we, we cover to cover into uh, some crazy damage and remember this build works like striker so you can build stacks before you do your cover to cover get into position smash people because the only things that get rid of uh, your stacks are reloads switching the weapon uh just but doing the cover to cover to move does not get rid of your stacks right so carry your stacks with you, give yourself this damage bonus, you beefy tough guy, smash somebody's face in, one hit, do over a mil, <laughs> be nasty about it, huh? Right? If you wanted to know about the mods, I've got, like, mods to just adjust, I adjusted the firearms up to 6,000, and I adjusted electronics up a little. I could have put stamina up to 7k if I wanted to. Our firearms up to 6.5. Uh, it's fine. You could have like a 6.5, 6.5, uh, 3 build. Or you could do the, um, anywhere. Honestly, you're probably the best off, uh, doing like a, uh, a 9.4.3 or a, even a 9, uh, a 9.3.4 build so you can get things like, um, Competent unlocked. Competence, uh, firearms and unlocks. I don't think. Stand. It's firearms electronics. So you need only 4,000. So I would do like a 9 4. I'm gonna go crazy and like stay, stay at like 100 meters and just wreck people. With headshots at like a hundred. Oh yeah, and let me 
let me reiterate how far <laughs> how far this thing shoots uh the optimum range on this guy you can check on your character sheet by uh current optimum range is uh 113 meters Th that is bananas crazy um audio where where is where'd it go <laughs> where is my sound it's scaring me how quiet it is in this headset oh well it's for now it's okay uh yeah, so you got your range here. So 113 meters. I most enemies uh only draw in at like 100 meters for me. So like as soon as they draw in, like they're already within range for me. I can start pegging them. Um So I can really stay super far away and uh watch things like um uh, where they turn in their uh, manhunts. That's an easy thing to set up for. Um, extractions. The works. You know, just... We'll find... Well, I'll try and find situations where it's useful. But um, I'm going to try and stick to this uh, setup where I'm doing my sniper deal. Running around doing extra damage. But, uh, I think for now, uh, that's the build. And I'm really uncomfortable without sound, so I think I might just end it here and then figure out what's going on with the sound and then come back and then do a, uh, week of, just start my week of right now and do one of the, uh, DZ Nights streams. Other than that, what's going on? Going to the right place. It's just stopped sending audio. Check something. It's, it's just gone. <laughs> Why? It's the first time I've run into this bug. Uh. Oh boy. Okay, well. I think we'll just end it here for now. I see a lot of my friends jumping on. I'll see if I can jump in with them and we can do another stream. Back to back. Uh, but this has just been a build anyways. So, uh, got any suggestions, you can send them in the chat. Um, if you think Meticulous is a good idea. You know, if I can... Sp I like Toxic, but maybe not on this build. Um, but maybe with the firearms this low, it might be fun to have Toxic in there. Uh, I like Vicious, just because of how high my stamina is. I don't know. If you got suggestions, comments, concerns, build ideas. You can hear me? Yeah. I know you can hear me, but I can't hear the game. The game's gone. <laughs> it's, it's disappeared. There's no game audio. There is sound? I I personally can't hear the game audio. Uh Yeah, you should Yeah, I can see that my mic is on. I can see that my mic is working. It's just that the um the game audio it looks like is gone, but uh I I Yeah. There should there should be game audio like the ambient noises and stuff like the menu the it's just weird. I might just relog and see what's going on. Cause I can, if I can't hear the uh, yeah that's what I'm gonna do I'm just gonna reboot. <laughs> it's worrisome. <laughs> I'm really I'm really not happy about it. It's so eerie, Joker. It's so eerie. 
I'm I'm nervous. It's making me nervous. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna reboot everything and I'll jump back on and I'll join you. I'll see if we can get Amanda in our group too. Maybe I can run around with this thing and uh, ruin our time. So I'll be right back, Joker. <laughs> oh, jeez. That's good. I got everything done, though. That's the whole build. Good enough. Yeah, nah, I kept it real short, too. That was a build video for once, and not, you know, a two-hour build video with a stream at the end of it. So, there you go. I've been P2H. You've been a schmuck. You gotta lie, cheat, and steal. If somebody has to win, and it should be you. P2H, out!